Hello viewers, welcome to Random Stuff. There was a popular saying, yesterday is history, tomorrow is a mystery, today is a gift of God. That is why we call it as present. So today I came back with the remembrance of our nation's great poet, the writer of our national anthem and India's first Nobel laureate, Sri Rabindranath Tagore. Rabindranath Tagore was a well-known poet, song composer, author, playwright and a painter who used literature to paint both the picture of society and the individual. Tagore's foresight helped produce numerous relatable emotions. On the other hand, his writings also presented a mirror to society. The first non-European person to win Nobel Prize for Literature was Rabindranath Tagore and he was born on May 7, 1861 in Calcutta. Here are some lesser known facts about unparalleled artists. The first one, he is the only person whose songs are used as national anthem for not one but three countries. Apart from India's Janaganamana, Bangladesh anthem Amar Sonar Bangla was also Tego's creation. The lyrics of Sri Lanka's anthem were translated from Tagore's work in Bengali. Second, he did not like the stereotypically set up of a school. He himself refused to go to one and was homeschooled. Later, his visions of liberated teaching was realized through Vishwabharati University. Third, Tagore was an avid traveler and traveled to more than 30 countries adapting foreign norms and spreading Indian culture. Fourth, Tagore was a contemporary of scientist Albert Einstein. The literator met the scientist at Later's house in 1930 and a conversation about science and divine and philosophy and nature of the universe. Fifth, his relation with Mahatma Gandhi was of mutual respect and admiration. Despite having contradicted what each other considered better for the freedom struggle, it was Tego who conferred the title of Mahatma on the father of nation. 